everybody this is yours truly the trigger tray here from the good old killer instinct squad and today we're playing some more of the walking dead season one today's episode episode three long road ahead so sit back relax and enjoy the show let's do this previously on the walking dead get the gates open we've got wounded i want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea you've been good to me and my family you saved duck from those monsters and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies Tell us. back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Okay, we're getting into it. Long road ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. I'm gonna say I don't like it. I don't like it. Keep your eyes open, all right? Just trying to be optimistic. Hey, Dark Let's Link, what's just up? Get inside. staying or going you mean packing up the motel and getting in the RV yeah we've been talking about it but have you made up your mind yet I'm gonna say we should go we should go the motels run its course and it's not safe you damn right it has we pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water and if Lily's dead set on staying then well that's the way it goes yeah, if you want the mod, go ahead. I can send you something tomorrow. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <sighs> Shit. You okay? The ladder's coming. Appreciate loose. it. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Hmm. Try to move this truck. Mm. That ain't going nowhere. Huh. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Guess we can uh, climb this ladder, maybe. Uh oh. Well, that Looks ain't like working. Had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Tried pushing the jeep, it didn't go in the... Hold up, hold up, hold up. Maybe this will work. Lily's not doing so good, huh? <coughs> well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad.
Hook it right there. Nothing I can do there. Look at the tire. It's completely flat. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? I haven't, I asked. haven't asked. Just gonna let it stew, huh? Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Still? It was so a scary situation for him. Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. <sighs> okay, let's get on. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit! Oh, that had to hurt. <sighs> what are you Jesus. okay? Are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. No! 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 Uh oh. Hey! Don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Get her away up the hill. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Oh, she got bit. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this mess. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. No! 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 I'm gonna pop her ass. I don't regret that later. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! It's sturdy as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Get all this. I think that's all of them. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Up and over. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have shot that girl. Still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, Jimmy, help! Oh no. Get off of me. Shit. Okay. 
also. back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Gotta stay hydrated. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. No, that's sus. So, what did you get? A lot, of stuff. a lot of stuff. Well, not quite. We got some stuff, not a ton. Half of it's probably expired. There just wasn't a lot left. This it? Yeah, well, we've been picking Macon clean for weeks. <sighs> Fuck. Which is why I've been saying, and I don't want to sound like a broken record here, but we gotta hit the road. He's piling into an RV with you two what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. So do we do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. Add yeah, it she again, even let that go. Can it, Carly? Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me either. We're, going, we're strongest together. We're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lovey. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know what about it? medicine? We'll be. We got all the protection we need. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? They won't be going back over. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She oh, was so making enough noise you? that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. Instead of what? Letting her suffer? I couldn't let her suffer. We're all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. Damn, who saw you on, Kitty? Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers, and the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Day. Now everybody get out! Happy Kenny? That's what I'm going with. Happy Kenny? My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Oh, 
things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good too. Yeah, Kenny a bitch. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. It's Lily's room. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in yeah, here? Let's talk to her real quick. Follow me. Follow up about the stolen supplies. Follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? I'm not stealing Of course you shit. think the black guy did it. I came it. in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. Counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. All right, I guess. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. I'm gonna say, okay, okay, I'll poke around. I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. Yeah, blame the black guy for everything. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. Your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Yeah, I'm the threat this lawyer. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. I will live in the shadows. Looks like Duck is going to help anyway. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. I think about you too. Uh, trying to get me some too. pussy. Our group is small. You're small. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. I'm gonna say it's a lifetime ago. It was ago. a lifetime ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. 
So you'll do it then? No. No. I'm not doing that. People have enough to worry about. What are you so afraid of? Three months ago I told you to tell no one and now I'm telling you to tell everyone. Do you think it's because they'll turn on you? We almost got eaten for fuck's sake. Things are different now. I hope you change your mind. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Uh, I'll say, do you know anything about this flashlight? Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. I'm gonna say, you have any thoughts about you, Lily? Uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Do you feel safe here? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. A car. Oh, that was worthless. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. I'll be saying what you're doing there. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Hey, do you like it do here? Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I need to tell you Friend, something. I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. I'm gonna go away. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car, and I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Anything way over here? The flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. <sighs> okay then. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Well, I'm gonna say I need to tell you something. Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure, Lee. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I'm gonna say I'm on my way to prison before I this. I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What, um, were you in for? It's not important. Oh, 
Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. And now you know. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben. You look like Shaggy from okay. Scooby-Doo. Or let me talk to these two. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry hey, little guns boy blue, now. What's going on? Thanks for stopping like by. It. It's the way How's it's got to be. Going? I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Appreciate that. Dark Link. Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you, uh, knew I was a convicted felon. Looks well, like my stream elements is messing up. How much okay, there can it is. a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife, uh... That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. I'm gonna say okay. I held Lily back and Kenny made sure Larry didn't get up. What did he do? He smashed his head in. <gasps> okay, got that off his chest. Gotcha. Everything keeps changing. Hi, guys. I'm gonna say, Kenny, you got a second? Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? It's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. <laughs> I was uh, Going option a. on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. It wasn't for touching kids, was it? Oh, <laughs> man, come on, man. Well, I, I gotta ask. No. I killed a guy in a fight. Hmm. Must have been a real piece of shit if you had to haul off and kill him. So we're straight then. Lee, look at everything this mess has got us doing now. I'm sorry you went through whatever you went through. Yeah, we're straight. Hey, big news. How's it going? Thanks for stopping by. Hey. Find anything? I'm gonna say I need to tell you something. I need to tell you something. What is it? I was sent to prison before the plague. You think that's news? I guess I hoped it was. Worse. Did you think that story died with my dad? Anything All right, else? Give me a second, Dark Link. No. Ugh. Ugh. North Carolina, raise up, take your shirt off, throw it around your head just like a helicopter. Okay, that's the North Carolina Redemption. Hopefully I don't get another one of those tonight. Ugh. Are you waiting for a COD update? 
I haven't played COD in a while. I might have to start streaming that again. I uh, talked to Let's Kenny go with about this. who I am. I thought you weren't going to do that. I changed my mind. And? He was cool. He just worries about his family. That wasn't so hard, was it, tough guy? I talked to Katja. I thought you weren't going to do that. I changed my mind. And? She was fine, I guess. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Because of the St. John's? What exactly did he do back there? Oh, don't you start now. I talked to Clementine about things. I thought you weren't going to do that. I changed my mind. How'd she handle it? I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. I uh, told Ben. You told Ben? Okay, we gotta get into some action. I changed my mind. Funny you picked him. Low risk. I take it he didn't know what to do with the information. Not even a little. He's just happy I told so him. So what you playing, something. Big Nude? Warzone? Or Team Death Match? I told Lenny. I thought you weren't going to do that. I changed my mind. And? You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. It went about as well as you would expect. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. Check out this broken glass. Hmm. Oh, they just dropped season two? I barely even played season one. Pink. Hmm. Doc. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I thought I told you you couldn't help. I'm curious. You don't say. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Okay, now I gotta figure out what to do. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. He really ain't gonna go nowhere. I can leave him hanging. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Ask if you found anything, anything else? else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Okay, I won't. You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk, you found the scuff here. This is gonna sound crazy, but you're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. But I find out who's been stealing shit.
Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, she says she's missing a piece of it. Well, I don't know anything about that. Sorry, Lee. Hey, Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... well, my thoughts, and I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. We go talk to Lily and then a chick upstairs. Hey. Find anything? Are you worried about morale at all? The darker things get, the more we have to worry about people giving up. Tell me about it. You're worried about people's moods? Have an ice cream social. Do you ever want to leave here? I want to leave here when we have to, not because of some fantasy of somewhere better. So, you think the coast is a pipe dream? Don't you? We're going to live on the water because we assume they can't swim? We're alive because we've stayed here. That's as far as the discussion needs to go. I'll be back. All right, we're going to talk to the chick upstairs. Do you have any uh, chalk I can borrow? What, Clementine holding out on you? So you don't have any? No, why would I? Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. I gotta figure out where to go. Feel free to backseat. Anything in this stuff? Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. I've talked to everybody. A car. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. But we need them. There's no doubt about that. You guys trust everyone here? You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. I don't know how straight we can get it, given all that's happened. So what then? Time will come, we'll have to do what's best for our families. And that's what we'll do. I'll talk to you later. 
Hi, Lee. Have you seen anything weird on the watch? I'm Is there him some more anybody questions. out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. What do you think about Lily? She scares the crap out of me. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Did you ever come down here to Macon much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Macon. Oh. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. It's super nice. I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is... Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. Now get over there. It's Lily's room. I've talked to everybody. Let me try Lily again. Hey. Find anything? I'll be back. Still the safest place for us. Stay inside the gate. I will, I will. Just be a coincidence. Okay, this is starting to get on my fucking nerves. Uh, definitely weird. I've literally searched everywhere. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. How's the drawing? Good. Good. Check near the front. Thanks for that. Somebody was over here, too. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. There's a grate down there. <clears throat> Son of a bitch.
You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. Pulls a bag out of his ass. There's a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, We've got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking indoors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep him <coughs> talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life! <sighs> shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta! That's why! Ooh, what will we'll it take, take to reach a deal. deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up or I'll... Christ! Oh shit! Shut him right in his ass. Get back there! Smoke him out! We gotta get out of here! No shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Got one. Got two. Now! Get over here! Hurry! Man, you saved our asses. Get inside! Hide in me! Help! Gotcha! Hang on! Uh -huh. Where is he? He's right behind that man! Get your asses around behind! Hang on! Oh, wait it. Can't invert the control. Sorry, I play inverted.
God is ass. Hurry, come on! Flip, get inside the RV. It's gonna be okay. Go! She wasn't bitten, was she? Then they get in the RV! Screw her! Let her stay! Damn, Kenny! Shit! Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm sorry. Everything's fine. Everything's ben. not fine. We need to figure out how this happened. We just lost everything. Well, we're lucky as shit to have this RV. And nobody died. Cat's head is split I'm open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back yeah, there. Yes, sir. Got Bandits him. have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Carly, is there something you want to say? Please. We have to get it out of you then. Back off. You are in no position to make demands. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're just pointing fingers. I I'm didn't say just maybe come it up was her. Oh no, 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 I hit the wrong button. Maybe it was. Lee, her. come on. I don't have anything to hide. Are you saying someone does? Damn, I hit the yes. wrong button. I don't have shit to hide. I read it wrong. Know it. Like, look, maybe we should vote or something like that. Vote? What? Just look. Carly's a stand-up gal, and maybe this was all just a mistake. We need to look at the facts. Let's calm down, we'll eat, and we'll deal with it. Guys, we have to act now. I know it sounds nuts, but we have a traitor here. Do you guys get that? Someone who puts their insidious shit above everyone else. Thank you, Lee. Nobody was stealing anything! Was it both of you? What? I've seen you two together. Was it both of you? Look, just let me out. I didn't do it, but I don't like this. I don't like where it's headed. Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. Lily, lay off of him. I... Shit! What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. All right, well, we can deal with this now, then. Kenny, is it safe? Should be. Everybody out. Lily... Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just Fucking kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. I'm not gonna take this. You can push Ben around, but you can't push me around. I'm really sorry you feel that way. I'm not doing Starting this. Starting to think maybe it was both of you. I'm not doing this. Come on, Lee. You're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. We're out here on the side of the road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Ha, huh, the hell you will. I'll get more stop food, more medicine, anything. Stop panicking. Seriously, Ben. You need to stop and just take a breath. 
Do we need any more evidence than this? Fuck evidence. Stop treating him like this. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Then you have until that walker is dealt with to tell me it was her and not you. Stop this. You're torturing him. No. Ben, stop. This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Tell her. Just do it, Ben. Lee, Jesus, well, who are you right Tell now? Tell her what? She'll kick me out of the group. We won't. We'll understand. Tell me. Now. There. I got him. Please, let's just get back That's in the That's not RV. happening. You think you're some tough bitch, don't you? Like nothing can hurt you. But you're just a scared little girl. Hey, hey, oh, Jojo, thank you. Thank, thank you, thank you, thank you. Take a page from Lee's book and try helping somebody for once. Man, stomped his head in. Now, what the fuck's the problem? Oh! Appreciate it, darling. Drop it. I was not expecting that. Holy fuck. Kenny, what's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. She couldn't be trusted, Lee. I swear. Please. I'm gonna say you're not coming with us. You're not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. I don't care what he did before. If we keep you with us, how long until you get me? I was trying to protect all of us. Yeah, I don't she have definitely got got. Left. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. Lee, a word, please? What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? Oh, what shit. The fuck. Not the kid. What happened during the raid. He's going to turn. He's going to turn. We don't know that. Gotcha. What do we really know? None of us have been bitten. We don't know what the time frame is for a child. We know nothing. I'm going to monitor him and focus on the wound and see if his condition changes. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Important to stay honest with each other. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. Duck is bit. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Carly? I want to say gone, but won't come back. Cause no option Y. That's right. It's horrible. Yeah, it is. Go option A. Start once. But he lived. Oh yeah, it was scary though. This one time, these boys from the other side of town were hassling him. He was on his bike, and 
They were in a truck throwing things at him. Calling her names. Stuff like that. And this tough son of a gun, he, he pedals up after him, he catches him, he pulls his bike up alongside the truck and jumps into the back and starts beating on him. He teaches all three of them a lesson, but the truck's still moving, you see. And just as he stands up to jump out, it zooms underneath a tree and a branch hits him square in the face. He goes flying out the back. Anyway, if, if he can live through that, I'm sure Duck can live through this. Got something up ahead. Damn it. Roads blocked. Now we got to deal with this. I'm going to take a quick restroom break. I will be right back. I'm back. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What, you think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. so but this looks recently used be on the lookout and have your guard up a 
map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. I'll take Get that water. For Doc. Take a look in here. Nothing in there. Nothing in there either. I can do here yet. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No. Okay then. You uh happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods, just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Sweet Pea, you okay out here? Oh, poor Duck. I don't think Duck feels good. Yeah, me neither. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Hey man, we're still looking around and haven't figured much out yet. It's fine. Radiator could use a rest as it is. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. See why my phone was going off. Okay, I've talked to everybody.
Nothing out here. This thing free if I can break it loose first. There's gotta be a better way to do this. Shit, broken. Maybe it's that one of the other tools that'll fit do that. Go take a look. Try that one. Bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. There's got to be a better way to do this. Wasn't that? I can talk to someone. Hey man, we're still looking around and haven't figured much out yet. It's fine. Radiator could use a rest as it is. I didn't even think it checked this. Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. <laughs> Suppose we ought to look him over. Yeah. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. Took his own life. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. 
We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. Let's get this one. Nothing left in here. Uh, uh, it's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Okay, that's not coming off. Try this again. Nothing. Okay, so none of these tools work. Is there anything in the engine I can do? No. Hey, Ken. What's up? God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. You want to talk about that? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. I don't know about leaving Lily back there. Abandoning someone on the side of the road is the same as murder. Don't worry about it. We just would have had to deal with her eventually. I'll get back to it. Me too. Where's the dude with the walker? I have no idea what to do with these. What is his name, Ben? He went somewhere with the walker. I gotta find out where he went.
Okay. Nothing in here. Where the fuck did that guy go? We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Carly or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Oh, excuse me. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. Are you okay? I know you were fond of her. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. I do. Don't. I liked her, but she's gone now. I'm sorry, Lee. How's that? Feel free to backseat. I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. Is Ken all right? What is he doing? He's put his mind to figuring out the train. What about you? Same thing. Sort of. I found some instructions, but I can't read them. Oh. Well, I'm sure someone can help you. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Okay, so you said it might be in the RV. And I was just in here. Oh, well, I'll take that pencil. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. All right. I'm not going to memorize all that. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Okay, six is done. Now we're talking.
No. Actually, maybe. Hey, Ken. What's up? With the directions I was able to piece together, I, I think I might be able to get this thing started. Uh, I don't know. It's a long shot. I don't even know what the fuel situation is with this thing. We'll find out. You mess around in the engine compartment yet? All right, then. Yep. So, engine compartment... Nine. Where is number nine? Jesus! I like to. Weakest jump scare ever. I thought those things were designed to save lives. He's pinned in there good. Too hard. in pretty good shape for a wreck. Nothing about the train. Oh, I'm going to the engine compartment. Okay. Hmm. Holy shit, we're golden. So what? We're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour. I don't care about the noise. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah.
try this again. Kenny, we're loose. You touch any of my stuff? Hey, who are you? Who are you? The guy who owns that stuff. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Yeah, yeah you, you are kind of freaky, dude. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Looks like we need to watch out for Chuck. He giving kids candy. I'm gonna say welcome. Welcome. Thank you. You bet, Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got. Although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. Taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Why are you alone? Talk to Chuck for a little Why bit. Why not? Seem to be doing all right. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. I better get back to it. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? Who's a smart ass? So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Want a ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. 
getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can't ignore this. Look at the kid, Kenny. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it were, what can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Kent. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. All of a sudden, they know to operate the train. Left that one walker in the car. be hard on you, eh? Three adults, taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. Yeah, we're, we're more of us. More of us. Dad, get him? No. Ah, living got him. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? I said we throw his ass off the train. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. I'm gonna go get Kenny. Hold on tight in case the train stops fast. I'm gonna get this train stopped right quick. I'm stopping the train. Stay put. Okay. Let's go talk to Kenny. You need to stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken! What the hell's that? Your, Your son's, son's blood. blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. He won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. You're in denial! And you've given up! On Duck, on everyone! Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or uh -oh. what? No, I'm not gonna fight him. I don't know what the hell is wrong with you, but you need to lock it up. Be a man here. Oh, you want a piece of me? Is that it? I just want to talk. I just want to talk, Ken. Relax. I don't want to fight inside of a train. And talk. You think you're the reason Duck was bitten? 
Like you had this coming or something? I'm gonna say... You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid. And a bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. You know that. Stop the train, man. Mm -mm. Okay, let's stop with the train. Again, it's... I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not know, <coughs> is foolish. But no. There's. This is kind of emotional. Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hun? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's. Here or nothing. Fuck. Just who then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I, I I'll can't. Do it. I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest, so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Of course, my belt stabbing me in my stomach. Let me. I'm just gonna take the damn thing off. There. his misery I'm putting him out of his misery oh yeah look Clem things are what the no Ben take Clementine into the train go it'll be fine uh oh She shot herself. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Why? Cat! Honey! Oh, fucking God! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you- She couldn't- She- 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 she just- Fuck! Oh, oh, fuck! Took her own life.
What do we do? I'm gonna say, give me the gun, I'll do it. Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Yeah, we don't need that burden on Kenny. Poor duck. I'm starting to feel bad for Kenny now. I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We do what's best for Clementine. We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl, like a gun. She's, She's a little, a little girl. girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plant, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. He's safe gonna exit. You betcha. Hey, man. You and me, we. Uh, oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure... Cat... would be, uh... okay with you. So forget it. Okay.
Hey, Ben. Hey. Uh, See you. I don't feel like talking to him anyway. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely taking that. It's a fifth of whiskey. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. I would say you need to learn to protect yourself. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. It'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Take a breath, hold it, and fire. When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. She's gonna smack herself in the face. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Aim right. Bit to the right. Aim higher. Okay, a little higher. Steady now. Almost got it. Aim a little higher. Aim a little lower. Close. Now keep it steady. Aim lower. I got it. Use up all Excellent. the ammo. Good shot. Sometimes we're gonna do this shit. I did. There we go. Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? My hands hurt and my ears have noise in them. Like, you'll get used to it. Hey, Maverick, how's it going? <laughs> and said Leisha just jumped her off a train. <laughs> I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe. Man, I said just leave Clementine off the train. Okay. 
Take it back to the front. Let me go see if Kenny's all right. that map mind if I get by you for a second Kenny can you just leave me alone are there any maps up here I don't know I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah hey dr. simple popper what's going on thanks for stopping by I'm going back to the train because I have no idea what the hell to do. He's lived here a while. Oh, the bag. They look clean enough. Oh, oh, oh. The scissors. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh, no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. It, it probably does, does smell. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> Am I in charge of the cut and I'm gonna give the bitch a mohawk? Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. do this I'm gonna say yeah of course yeah, of course I don't believe you well good good means you know when someone's lying to you which is another valuable survival skill so you did kill someone before yeah I'm glad you finally told me <laughs> give her that LGBT haircut <laughs> Lots of things. Looks like she already got it. Doesn't even matter. I'm gonna say killing is bad no matter what. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Yeah, especially blue. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Okay, can I go back and get that map now? I need that right there. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. I guess I'm going back out this way. A 
have found this if you wanted. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Yeah, we can go for a drink. Want a nip? Hell yeah. Sure. Oh, I gotta stretch. Ooh. Not known for its finish. Yeah, just Spartan kicker in the no back. Kid. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. I'm gonna say where you headed. Where you headed? Uh, that way. I mean, when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Hey, Maverick, appreciate that follow. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. I'm gonna say you homeless, dude. You're homeless, then. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and... Well, they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. I shot the kid, you know? I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. Okay. Can I get that now? Get out of here. This dude's really an asshole. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Got the map. Thanks. Wonder if I can offer something to Clem. Hey, little girl, you want something to drink? Hey, Ben. Hey. See you. Yeah. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. I knew it. It's all my fault. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill ben all should have died us. a while ago. I'm sorry, Lee. Yeah, he is a little bitch. You still want to talk to me? I'm gonna say not really. I didn't think so. Okay, we finally figured out who was stealing the shit. Uh, I think it was the word bitch that got auto blocked. Hey, I uh, approved it. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally Hold under up. control. The thing is, it was the word. We're a team, yeah, it was the word trash. Need to plan. I'm the one that said he's a little bitch. When this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We need to find a boat. We should look for your I parents. Think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah, I know. I was the one that said. I thought I saw okay. it in the message. If they're not. What happened to them? I'm sure they're okay. So yeah, stay positive. Yeah, it's best to stay positive. That's what Dad always says. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. 
Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm... Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. Oh, I got the stretch again. On here, but read this map and mm. maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. Oh, oh I just cracked the hell out of my shoulder. Um, um, something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. So we'll head there. Yes. You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. I'm gonna say, sure, go ahead. Sure, go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Uh-oh. Damn. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm yeah, just it is. Saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas, or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This? Yo! You keep screaming like that and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could've just kept walking. I'm gonna say no, we're friendly. No, we're friendly! Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody <clears throat> says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there. We won't let them escape. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find Ooh. out. Wasn't surprising one bit if they were. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. So we can use some good people. Uh, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and yeah, we we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit! God damn, you guys have a kid. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Someone says keep oh, him away from so the kid. He gets to swear. Oh, this is great. See, things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? Go option I came A. came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there. Oh, no, just shoot cool. them both? <laughs> I'm gonna say Kenny lost his wife and kid. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road, alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty no. easy. We'll start there. He's been sleeping. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can. He's been help. sleeping the whole time. Yeah. 
Okay, what are we doing? Look at this. It's empty. Well, can I take that? That's about the only useful thing in here. Okay, I got the tape. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. We like maybe move the truck. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan or what? Okay, let's go talk to them. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We We're gonna cut that tanker guys, down. Though. The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Alrighty. Okay, so I guess the station is the other way. Got a clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and, and exterminate them or something. I'm gonna say toughen up. Toughen up. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are gonna be a lot more walkers to take care of. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm telling you, Lee. If they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna... Yes, punch he does, Dorkling. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. And don't let them get a hold of you. Check out the train station. There? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Well, I feel it's gonna be a bad idea. Enough reading. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Oh, she just said it was locked. Hmm, won't but. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Oh, 
Okay, so that's locked. Hmm. Gotta find a way in there. We'll have to find a way in. You would think the way in is somewhere around here, maybe a rock? Somebody was doing some painting. Like, I can't pick up a bucket of paint and just throw it through the window. Somebody was doing a lot of painting. Alright, so there's someone in there. Can't see in there. Maybe there's something on the side, then. Nope. I think I'm gonna head back. If I'm going the right way. Was there a rock or something I could use? That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Not sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask Omid. He likes to break things. Where are you from? San Francisco. Geez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? Nothing. If you're gonna be around for a while, it'd be good to know what baggage you got. Then maybe we won't be around for a while. Careful, she's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Yep. Well, look, I don't need to lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. We go up that ladder again. would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. Where's that guy at? He ain't up here. Inside the train.
You like Civil War history, huh? Fuck yeah. What do you know about some Quantrill's raid? Well, it happened about a thousand miles that way. Well, yeah. And we're headed the other way. But if it's somehow not crawling with the dead, there should be some cool things to see. Excellent. Don't tell Krista, though. That won't be as big a selling point for her. You got it. How have you two made it this far? You seem dangerous anymore. Or Omid. Krista doesn't let us join groups. And I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please. I've saved her ass hundreds. Tens. Sometimes. How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while and then, you know. That's rough. Her cat is gonna be pissed. Learning the ropes? Can't be too hard, right? There are a lot Ugh, of things I can't to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Talk to you later. Teaching them anything? Trying to. Okay, so it's established. I don't come in here. I must go over here. There's gotta be some over here I missed. One thing I didn't do is read two things on the walls. Which I don't think has anything to do with anything. Oh, what about that? The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? There was something here. We'll have to find a way in. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. What do, you, what see? do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Well, I'll be damned. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Uh-oh. God damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Is there anything up front? Nope. Locked up good. It's locked up good, but there's some space at the top. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. 
You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! Keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you. And he's dead again. I'm gonna figure this out. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! Fuck. I just gotta figure out what the kind of pattern is. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! No, oh, I can move. Okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Oh, crap. Keys, now! Fuck, it's still locked! Right in the head. <sighs> God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? We handled, we handled it. it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I hope you know what you're doing with her. Still alive, still alive, aren't we? Are we? Yeah, you are. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. It'll pass. They didn't have much business back then. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. 
What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got that option. Us, but we got them. Yeah, you're right. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? Okay, so we're gonna act like he didn't stick a giant propane tank up as well, huh? I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. as a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Good thing I got that tape. Hope this holds. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. Damn it, it was just about done, too. Crap. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no. But I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are. Well, you're gonna help. God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Uh oh.
<laughs> he bounced off the train. That was funny. Next stop, the Atlantic. We find in Clementine's parents when we get there. I thought they were dead. Looking for them then. That's not the plan. Well, it's ours. She and I talked it through. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents. Y'all might want to rethink your plan. Oh, that completes the episode. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you! Alrighty, this is the Trick or Trey here from the Good Old Killer Instinct Squad. I'm going to go ahead and end the broadcast. Next stream will be on Sunday at 6 p.m. Eastern. Uh, before I leave, let me find someone to read. Let me see who's all online. Okay, I'm not seeing anybody online, so I'm just going to go ahead and end the broadcast. Thanks for watching, and I will see y'all later.